Robert and Jesse, thanks, fellas. We are in a weather delay here in Norman, Oklahoma, which seems to have happened all over the country in college football this year. You saw, as I said, the ominous skies. We've had some lightning strikes. We've had a storm that has already passed through, and you can see it's still raining. And this a uh, uh, few moments ago, that'll kind of tell you why we've got a weather delay. And they tell us at this point they think it's going to be roughly a half an hour. Uh, we'll keep you updated as well as we can. Right now, we're going to go down and check with Holly, though, and what she knows about it. Holly? Well, guys, we've seen some visible lightning strikes around the stadium area, but checking with the Oklahoma people who have extra people on tonight knowing that weather could be an issue, they are outside of this six-mile radius that's required by the NCAA. So they're not asking people to evacuate the stadium yet. They are asking them to seek shelter inside the stadium. It's the safest place. They do see that that cell with the lightning, though, is moving away from the stadium. However, there is another cell coming in that does have some lightning strikes within it. So, guys, we're in a holding pattern here. We don't have an evacuation. People are just seeking shelter inside the stadium. The teams did not take the field. They were able to make that decision before the teams came out. We'll keep you posted here from Norman, Oklahoma. All right, Holly, we've all even heard the word hail at times. So we're going to let Holly get to the tunnel. We'll let some of the fans get underneath as well, and uh, we'll hide ourselves. Robert and Jesse are going to keep you updated on the Washington-Stanford game. We'll get this kickoff as soon as we can. This has been the Nissan pregame shift. Kickoff coming up whenever.